what's up guys welcome to my youtube channel hair system talk as you can see i'm back to uh, chrome dome again today but basically um so when what where i left off yesterday was obviously you know from the last video i got the haircut sorted out yesterday um this was the trimmer that i used to hit it with the number eight um as you can see just a number eight guard trimmer I did the entire hair system on my head with the trimmer now I did everything going down I think if I had gone up I would have probably fucked a lot of it up so I went down on the entire hair system and um, basically just for the haircut yesterday I only glued like a portion of it just so it was on the head for the haircut uh, just taking it off to kind of see how it, everything looks so basically as you see Got this little mannequin head here. I was kind of like doing, trying to do like a bit of haircut work and stuff on this one in my spare time. But I've just taken the unit off. Because as you know, when you have the really long hair, you know, five, six inches of a unit, and you lay it on with that kind of length, it's very easy for some hairs to get stuck on the, on the glue. Now it's come off um, and it's in a more manageable length. I'm just looking over it to see if there's, because basically i do see some longer hairs longer than other ones so i'm kind of just going over like um touch-ups basically and then i'm gonna fully secure it on my head so blending so just regular scissors i've got the thinning shears here but i'm just looking at anything that stands out to be a lot longer than the other hairs so that's all i'm doing right now um let's see maybe i'll put it up here but um just giving it a one over look because um, you can you can see some like slight imperfections I just wanted to tidy it up a bit more than anything that's what I'm doing here um, let's see what we got going on here it's not too bad as you can see here, when I did take it off, I um, don't know if I have them on me now. As you can see, this was like stuck under the hair system. And this was from basically the long hair when it's been um, applied. Some longer hairs got stuck underneath the unit when I laid it back. Um, and then also I was getting a little bit of curling on the front. So I wanted to take it off and kind of just start from the beginning again. Get this like slight bit of the curling on the front sorted out mid portion but as you can see there's a little bit of plastic of the additional here that i'm just trimming off now really just trying to line it up nice Might even take it slightly a bit back than that even. Because as you can see yesterday with the long hair, there is a few random hairs stuck on the system. So uh, I think it was a good idea to take it off, see how it was looking, if there's any hair stuck underneath, and then really apply the whole thing. Like I said yesterday, I just kind of did a temporary fitting while I got it cut. And I like to just take off tiny bits at a time because remember it's easier to take more uh, take small amounts off than take too much off and be fucked so that's how that's looking there before I did get some bending sticking inwards onto the system um, and I think that looks a whole lot better there it's the tiniest bit here I want to do I just want it to be as smooth and clean as possible, even though sometimes I'm going to wear the hairline down. I do want to know that if I want to wear the hairline up, that I'll be able to do so quite easily. How are we looking there? 
even a bit more can come off to be fair if I wanted the smoothest looking hairline I can take another tad bit off that will be it I'm happy with that there um, let's see what we got going on got some hair stuck in this one from yesterday when it was longer let me see if I can get some of these off without most of them off without ripping any of the hair And again, guys, a lot of this stuff is very easy to do. I've got a nice little bright light here. Um, I'll show you it. That's just what I use for my lighting, basically, just to get a little bit of extra light in here. And, you know, all my videos, I'm doing editing and everything off my camera, off my camera, off my phone. I think I've got, like, Cyber Edit or whatever it's called. That's what I've been doing my editing on. Some videos, I don't even bother editing. just depends what type of video it is. This is the little cleanup maintenance video today. Probably won't do too much editing. But let's see, one final look over. <clears throat> so as you can see the back, that's how it would look. It's a little shorter, it goes a little longer and shorter again. Sides look about equal in length. Front's a bit shorter than the rest of it. Let's see, how's that look? All right, so I'm pretty happy with how everything's come out so far. I've got most of the hairs off the system. I've got some of this um, leftover C22. It's going to give the thing a spray. What do you guys think about the smell of that C22? You guys feeling the orange smell? I feel like it smells like some like WD-40, you know? It does smell a bit funky. Let that soak in for a bit. Spray it on my head. What I think I've decided to do is kind of, um, rather than um, putting glue on the lace, um, I've got some of that um, Walker's Ultra Hold tape. I might go a strip there and a strip there, and then the rest perimeter with the glue. So I'm going to use that tape and let's see if we can get some of this adhesive removed off. It's a little bit harder than normal where the glue's just kind of gone on yesterday. So the longer the glue's on your head, the easier it does become to remove, I've noticed. If it's the day after, it will be a little more temperamental to get it off, but doable nonetheless. So. All right, let's see where we are here. All cleaned up now. And everything is all Trimmed up to a nice even amount everywhere. Sides are both matching the same. Back, everything is looking good.
I've already hit it with some um, scout protector in those areas. There you go guys, this is the finished one. You can see the hairline is a lot easier to line up when it's shorter. You can see there's no skin bent in because I was having a little bit of that bent bent additional in the front. And now, yeah, can't see it. And this was just the fix up of the haircut yesterday.